right, guys, I'm with Dylan Johnson. Dylan, give us a, the two minute rundown of the race. Yeah, um, I'm so cooked right now, so if I'm babbling or <laughs> I, I, I'm, I was just laying on the floor for yeah. like 10 minutes. So the start was really easy. We were chilling for probably two hours. Probably three or four hours in, the pace ramped up a lot. And that's also when it started to get hot. The heat was getting to me. I think I got dropped maybe 90 miles in. Yeah. And uh, found a group of maybe six or seven to work with. And we, we kept catching riders in the second half, which was motivating. And then it was, a, I don't know, a four up, five up sprint finish here. And I got second out of the group that I was with, which for me, I'm not much of a sprinter, so I'll, I'll take it. <laughs> And I look at how you're uh, kitted up. Everything aero. Can you run us down your aero marginal gains yeah. or not so major marginal so gains? This is the uh, Starlight Apparel TT suit. Yeah. Um, Sleeves and uh, for, zipper in the anyone, back. For anyone who watches NorCal Cyclist, uh, he had a video where he um, he took this guy to the wind tunnel yep. and they tested this suit versus a couple others and this one was actually the fastest. Yep, I remember that. Um, got uh aero coach aero gloves these are supposed to save like a watt <laughs> cool uh got the rule 28 aero socks damn um i don't have aero shoes mainly because uh the feet kind of swell up in these gravel races and i want to and i want to be able to loosen on the fly but yeah and i did not run the aero helmet today just because it's so freaking hot and i wanted my head to stay cool and you're also running aero bars at the moment did you use oh, them yeah. today Oh yeah, yeah, for sure. In that second, in that second half, every time I was pulling, I was in the arrow bars. So, and also, why the number on the side and not in the front? Like I think you're supposed to. There's no rule against that. <laughs> the race, the race organizers, they get mad when you bend the number because it bends the timing chip, and then and then they you can't record your time. Yeah, that one's dead flat. <laughs> Yeah, and it's pretty smart because otherwise... Bet you, I'll bet you that's more aero than not having it on. I would <laughs> say it, you're right. I, I will start to run my gravel race numbers just like that. And, Sweet. And I'm sure I won't be the only one after watching this video. All right, thank you, Dylan. Yeah. Talk soon.